What's up, guys? This is Binary for here because Binary is so awesome. And welcome back to Let's Play Super Robot Wars Judgment. Last time, the finish line showed its face. It's right here. Tell King Gordon. Also, these guys are interesting. Um, as I think Ruri said, these are combined mecha beasts. And, uh, here, let's see if. No, no one can use scan. Rip. Oh well. You need some healing right now. now this one's gonna be kind of annoying because it's underwater. Also, for other reasons. Um, well, you're okay, energy now. Okay, well, what's your weapons? What are your weapons like underwater? Shitty. Let's do it anyway. We got this. Wait, is there anyone... Does anyone alive still have trust? Or alive. Alive and on the map. No. What's your SP look like? And... Oh boy, biscuit shall be risked. But uh, this isn't gonna quite look like the Venus that I'm sure most of you are familiar with, or perhaps not familiar with, since I never use it. You can see, it's got things coming out of it. Um, this un enemy is unfortunately one of the, uh, I guess, I don't really have a name for it yet, but I guess I'm going to call it shell frame type. Um, it's a type that basically, it's like, uh, that one uh, Zaft Gundam unit. The one with the armored shell around it. The one where you just have to destroy the outside and they have to destroy the inside. It's like that. It's a shell frame. There is an inner robot and an outer robot, and you have to destroy the outer robot to get at the inner robot. I don't know if it has an official name, but I'm going to be calling them shell frames. Probably. Um, at least as far as Super Robot Wars currently goes, in Super Robot Wars V, all divide frames are of that type. Can I dock in you? No. We still need to get rid of this one before that can be used, but... You know. No, is that still because I... Is that because I still have alert up? No, you're just that bad at hitting. I'm okay with this. Yeah, we're gonna basically have to kill this one twice, which is kind of annoying. Slacka's mecha was evil all along. That's why it was so bad. Of course. It all makes sense. Uh, anyway. <laughs> You're running a little bit kind of low on energy there. This just cost 30. Use this like once more.
Sorry, folks. Stop your nose. I kind of wish it would be... It would mute it. The mute would be a little bit more silent. But uh, instead it just sort of clicks. I don't think I can remove it. I'm going to be needing some energy soon, too. Jeez. Ooh, a Kaleesner formation. Let's not do that. <laughs> Let's not ruin our supply of energy. Almost. Um, I actually can't really do much about that. Because if I try to... I'm going to end up with... Um going to end up having to use a beam weapon, which means that it's not going to do anything to you. Oh, but wait, I have hidden away, so I can't actually do this. I'm a silly! I can't remember the last time I upgraded my unit to this stats was, I must have, like, a ton of money. <laughs> I can only imagine I have a stupid amount of money. And this is what Venus uh, A turns into once you destroy its outer hell, it becomes this abomination, which looks kind of like these, uh, snake duders. Yeah, these, uh, looks like a cross between those duders and Venus A. And it's really annoying. So we're just gonna double rocket punch it and call it a day. I'm not going to call it a day because we're going to have to do this a bunch of times, but you know what I mean. Of course, while we're dealing with this guy, you know who is still going to be making um, his slash her way towards us. So my plan is to deal with Venus A here as quickly as possible. <laughs> you still have the, the other repair kit, or are you done? Yeah, you're done. And we're down one healer, which is always fun. So, any phase. You go, then you go, then you go, then you go for some, some reason. Someone has decided to, um... But say vacuum, <laughs> mow the lawn, and I don't know if that's vi uh, if that's audible or not. You need health, so no, Eureka, do not block. Of course, I have to use something that can actually hit underwater. So, fun times. slightly away from the wall that appears to be making the that appears to be closest to the lawnmower sound in the hopes that it, in vain hopes that that will actually help and King Al is gonna yeah King Al is gonna stay right where he is you have health regen or something yes 
Well, fuck you. Well, aren't you just terrible? Lucky arm slaves. Luckily, arm slaves aren't too terrible. Like they don't use any laser equipment, so they're decent at taking care of underwater enemies. Though, to be fair. They don't move very well while underwater, so... Ooh, yes, yeah, so that didn't really need to happen, because it wasn't going to hit anyway, but it's cool to see it. Okay, now that you're up and running... I need to, like, you to vigor a whole bunch. Well, maybe, maybe only once. And I need you to... Guts, I think? Maybe, maybe I didn't. I don't know. Um. Let's get you to do this, because it's a pretty okay attack. It's pretty alright attack, because it can... It's got... It's... It's decent no matter what you're using it on. Any environment, totally okay. It's all good. Plus, it's just overall strong attack. Like, Stair Rhymer of the Skies, if you want to go for that secret, it's the secret involving it. It's pretty cool. I don't have it yet myself. I'm just going to do that, go into that blind, but it looks pretty all right. And Stair Rhymer is a pretty okay unit on its own. Oh, God, it's doing that. Why was it doing that? Uh, do I- I can't not use that on you. In that case, I'll just use it on you- oh wait. And then I remember why I moved Cypher over here. Oops. You got 60. You first. Who oh boy, you're gonna be a pain in the butt. Alright. Go for it, Kira. something stuff like my nose wasn't just didn't just feel stuffy it was stuffy like ugh. um of note Venus A spawns wherever you have the Nadesco so if I was smart I would have put the Nadesco on land but I'm not smart as we all know so that did not happen oh oops. I mean to deploy can you, like, go anywhere? You can! Do you have wall active? I don't think you have wall active. You do not. Put up wall, and then move over here. I get used to seeing this frame. It's probably the frame I'll be sticking on Kagai for quite a while. So used to fire emblem, and then I almost thought he said dastard, and I'm like, wait, what? 
because that's a fire emblem thing, because Bastard is apparently not kid-friendly. Well, I mean, it isn't, but... Man... Yeah, the great booster. This is the silliest thing ever. I still don't understand that attack. It's so weird. God. I don't know how loud that is for you guys. Fishing by Audacity is not very loud at all. But that is really loud on my end. And it can, like, duh. Double rocket punch power all the way across the sky. I am not sorry for that. Okay, and that's Evil Venus down for good. And Koji learned guard. Yay! Now the rest of our units can... You can start moving over here. <laughs> you are gonna need an energy supply like like literally everyone else. I'll start moving over here, and you can also start moving over here. And then you can just sort of poke a guy with a harpoon missile. This is the combined mecha beast, by the way. As you can see, it's it's a combination of a bunch of mecha beasts. It is true to its name. It's got like the dragon wings, it's got the double heads, and it's got the axe horn things. Yeah. It also means it has this attack, which means that it's got an annoying amount of range. Oof. Um, though the finish line is in sight, I would still urge you to save your spirit commands for just a moment longer. Like, just a thing longer, because, uh, things happen. You're going to need to start blocking and not really attacking, because, uh, you're running low on energy there. You're also running low on energy. Say I haven't had that happen in a while, but I haven't played Super Rubble. I've been mostly playing Super Rubble Wars V, which I guess that happens less. Either that or the ships just have more energy in that game. I don't know. Is there any el anything else I can do? I can use this. If I really start running low on energy. Um, Super World Wars V has a, uh, kinda better auto attack picking system, and by kinda better I mean it considers ammo and energy into it, but I don't always care. 
Like, Estevalis units, I, why would I care about that? They're just gonna resupply energy in the next turn anyway, because it's an Estevalis. Stuff like that. It's better usually, though. It, it, like, most of the time, it's a good thing to consider. Just sometimes it really doesn't matter. Um, you can just start blocking. Because I need you. Chris, I don't think we've seen that attack. Okay, we're going to see it again. Oh, yeah, he just pulls his horns off. They don't have a command ship. They're ground units. Uh, until next time, everybody, where we will probably get rid of just these jokers around here. More than likely, just uh, these guys. This one will take a bit more time. Until then, everyone.